Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given quadratic equation by completing the square. The very first thing we want to make sure that only x variables must be on the left hand side. That means this constant positive one must go on the other side. So we simply got 4x square minus 8x and this positive one simply becomes negative 1. The next step is we want to make sure that our leading coefficient, the coefficient of this x square must be 1. So that means I am going to divide by 4 across the board. So that is going to simply give us 1x square minus 2x which is equal to negative 1 over 4. Our next step is look at this, the coefficient of x only, which is negative 2. I am going to just write down over here, always divide that number by 2. That is going to give us negative 1. And then we are going to square it. Always we square it. So we are going to get positive 1. And also we know that this 1 could be written as 1 square, isn't it? So 1 square. So this is the quantity that I will add on both sides of this equation. So let's that add that quantity. So I'm going to write down x square minus 2x plus equal to negative 1 over 4 plus and now I am going to add this quantity on both sides 1 square on this side and 1 square on this side and now let's focus on our this left hand side part only and this represents a complete square by using this fact a minus b square equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square so i can write this one as x minus 1 square equal to here i can write this negative 1 fourth as a negative 1 over 4 and this 1 square is same as plus 1 and 1 could be written as 1 over 1 and now right up here I have copied down this number these fractions right up here let's simplify it let me show you an easy way let's crisscross cross multiplication negative 1 times 1 is going to give us negative 1 and then whatever this sign plus is just write down that thing let's cross multiply the other way around that's going to be a 1 times 4 is going to be 4 divided by these denominators you just multiply them out 4 times 1 is 4 on the top is going to be 3 divided by 4 so that means that this x minus 1 square turns out to be this these fractions are simplified to 3 over 4 and now since we want to solve for x I'm going to undo this square part cancel out this square part is by just taking the square root on both sides so you can see that this square and square root is gone so we simply ended up with x minus 1 equal to this simply become positive or negative we are putting positive or negative because we are dealing with the quadratic equation just keep in your mind and this is on the top is going to be square root of 3 divided by the square root of the denominator 4 is going to simply become 2 so now I am going to move this negative 1 on the other side so x is going to be equal to positive 1 positive or 
negative square root of 3 divided by 2. And now in the next step, we are going to split these numbers along with these positive and negative signs. So we are going to get one of the solution is going to become x equal to 1 plus square root of 3 divided by 2. The other solution is going to be 1 minus square root of 3 divided by 2. So thus our solution set turns out to be right up here and that is our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.